Oscar nominee Paul's character will face off against three-time Emmy nominee Pedro's Roman general-turned-gladiator, man-eating baboons, and a rhino-riding warrior in Gladiator 2, which opens in theaters in the U.S. and the U.K. on November 22. Paul played Lucius Verus, Spencer Treat Clark, the adult nephew of the deceased Roman emperor Commodus Joaquin Phoenix, who admired Maximus Decimus Meridius, Russell Crowe the former general who was enslaved before becoming a gladiator. In addition to Matt Lucas, Fred Hechtinger, May Calamai, Leor Raz, Peter Mensa, and Tim McInerney, Gladiator 2 will involve men fighting on top of enormous boats in shark-infested waters. In the pre-recorded opening, Paul said, Working on this film was one of the standout moments of my life to date. It is a good day to work in any context when you get to go to work every day with Sir Ridley Scott behind the camera. Speaking openly earlier this summer, Nell maintained that her success in the music business is entirely due to her own diligence and not her well-known brother. In a recent Frank interview, the composer discussed the effects of her brother's celebrity, the Normal People alumnus, who rose to stardom in Normal People and starred in Gladiator 2 is among the most sought-after actors of the last five years. Nell has since stated that she was advised to change her last name when she was first signed for her music and moved to the UK in order to eliminate the connection to Paul. Many people asked me if I wanted to change my name to just Nell when I first signed and moved to the UK, she added. No, I adore my name. Many people will believe that whatever room I enter is due to one particular thing, her brother but I've accepted that it's not the case. I am aware that my hard work has brought me to this point. It's odd to see so many people fall in love with him, but of course because he's such a great guy, she continued while discussing Paul's notoriety. It's beautiful to watch him put in so much effort and see the results. The parents of the siblings and their brother Donachar Paul, a schoolteacher, and Durbla Gardi, both are from Manuth in County Kildare. She went on to say in the interview that the siblings are genuinely best friends and that they spend most of their time together doing typical things like watching movies and ordering takeout. Back in May, Paul supported his sister Nell by going to the release of her most recent debut EP, Can I Miss It For A Minute? Paul joined his glitzy sister Nell to the event, looking laid back in blue jeans and a boxy white t-shirt. Nell stated in January that Can I Miss It For A Minute? is a concept EP about growing up, moving away, friendship breakups, and attempting to balance present feelings with unpleasant recollections, according to the line of best fit. Every song has a beginning, middle, and end and conveys a portion of the same story. While some songs are composed in the present, others are composed in hindsight. It discusses my life and how I handle situations that have influenced who I am. Above all, I believe it's about letting go of things that once held me back. Following a postponed run of UK gigs, Nell and her band embarked on an eight-date tour that began in Nottingham and concluded in London's Omera on January 31st.